Good day, my name is Vasily Tarasenko and I'm a Russian attorney. And today we'll talk about how in Russia spouses divide foreign property located outside Russia, uh, that is, at another country. Also, at the end of uh, this video, I will tell you in what cases you can protect yourself from the division of jointly acquired property. Let's get it started. So, in our practice, we often need to divide community property located outside the Russian Federation and we know that the division of foreign property has many features which we will share with you in this video. To begin with, uh, let's say that according to the legislation of the Russia Federation, in the event of a division, all property acquired by the spouses is divided down the middle, even if one of the spouses was unemployed and the family's income consists entirely of earnings of one spouse. And this rule is no exception including for foreign property in relation to Russia. I will talk about exceptions for the division of the property equally at the end of this video also. So the foreign property of the spouse is the community property and is subject to division equally. However, the division process itself is complicated by international law and the Russian courts have many questions which I will tell you about in this video. So, is it possible to divide foreign community property in Russia court? You can apply to a Russian court for the division of foreign property in the case when one of the spouses doesn't live in Russia and he or she doesn't have Russian citizenship also. But the last joint place of residence of the spouses was in the Russia Federation. So the key here is the last joint place of residence of the spouses. If it was in Russia, then the Russian court is the competent authority to determine the rights of the spouses in the foreign community property. This rule is enshrined in the paragraph 3 of Article 27 of the Hawke Convention. It names on legal assistance and legal relations in a civil family and criminal matters. What documents and evidences are you need to distribute foreign property? This is the most common task to be solved since the obligation to provide evidence lies with the plaintiff. The plaintiff, when filing a claim, must provide the following evidence for the court. Evidence of the marriage, first of all, that is a marriage certificate, evidence of property acquisition during the marriage, Evidence that the spouse owned this property at the time of the division of property. The list of evidence depends on the nature of the property. For example, in order to collect evidence, a spouse acquired shares in a European company during the marriage you need. For example, in order to collect evidence, a spouse acquired shares in a European company during the marriage you need. An extract from the trade register of the country where the company is established. Each state has such a register, for example, in Ireland. This register is maintained by CRO, Companies Registration Office, Ireland. In the example of the trade register of Ireland, such an extract is called company printout, a financial statement of the foreign company which reflects the spouse's ownership of shares. On the example of the trade register of Ireland, such a document is Form B, annual return. An extract from the register of beneficial owners may also contain data on the ownership of shares. You can order from us to obtain an extract form the trade register of a foreign state in relation to a foreign company or an extract or a beneficial owner by applying by email. In what form should property documents issued in a foreign state be provided for a Russian court? If a document confirming the rights to a property was drawn up at another state, it must be apostille translated and notarized. The essence of an apostillization is a fixing on the apostille stamp on the documents by the competent authority of a foreign state. Apostille is a simplified way of legalization of foreign documents which is used in countries that has signed Hawk Convention of uh, 5th of October 1961. This convention has been signed by most developed countries. The list of countries you can see on our website. Apostille is a procedure that must be followed in any case because otherwise the Russian court will not accept your evidence 
even if it confirms the ownership of a company. As for the translation and notarization, documents must be provided for the Russian code in the Russian language. Since the documents were issued in a foreign language, not in Russian, they have to be translated and certified by a Russian notary. You can also order us to translate and notarize documents. What foreign property can be divided? First of all, it's a real estate, cars, vehicles, also it can be companies, it can be cash, bank accounts, furniture, household appliances and other movable things. Also salaries, income from commercial and intellectual activities, also jewelry, and luxury items. What property received abroad cannot be divided? Let's discuss this question. According to Russian family code can't be divided personal property of each of the spouses. The following property belonging to you will not be divided. Also received by you before marriage, bought before the marriage and also donated property and property acquired by inheritance. Also personal belongings used only by you. Also, objects of intellectual property. These are copyrights for works of art, books, songs, films, etc. So, if you need help with the division of property in Russia, you can reach out to us. My name is Vasily Tarasenko. I'm a Russian attorney. Subscribe, please, on our channel. And I wish you good luck. Bye.